The following contest is scheduled for one fall with a five minute time limit in the light heavyweight division. Now making his way to the ring from Detroit, Michigan. D. J. Smart. And his opponent making his way to the ring from British Arts Unknown. Some say he is the illegitimate child of Katie Vick and the Gobbledygooker, and that he drove the Hummer. All we know is he's called the Stig. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the first ever White Day Massacre. It is White Day here in Japan. That is the reverse Valentine's Day. I'll explain that a little bit more later. But right now, we're starting off light heavyweight action. DJ Smark versus The Stig. I'm getting really good at timing those ring bells, aren't I? Okay, quick knee lift, and uh, down goes the DJ. All right, welcome to White Day Massacre. Uh, White Day. Valentine's Day in Japan is traditional for women to give chocolates to guys that they like. On White Day, a month later, the reverse is true. Men give chocolates as sort of a return gift to the women who so favored them the past Valentine's Day. It's one of the greatest uh, marketing gimmicks in the history of uh, Japanese culture and one of the few holidays that it is openly admitted was started by the candy companies to boost sales. In uh, celebration of this touching display of greed, uh, the AWL has dedicated their March pay-per-view, our March pay-per-view, to this uh, auspicious event. Starting off right now with two of the better light heavyweight wrestlers in this company, DJ Smark and former light heavyweight champion, The Stig. This uh, match come, came about uh, because of their match a few weeks ago where the Stig was defeated by DJ Smark, and Smark used the Stig's own finishing move, the running power bomb, better known as the power lap. And speaking of power lap, Stig making a lap all the way across the ring as uh, DJ Smark whips him pillar to post, and what's this? Uh-oh, remixer! Disconnected. The former DJ going for one of his moves, the, his signature move is the remixer, Unfortunately, uh, Stig able to get out of the corner. Attempted a power bomb by the power bomb master, but Stig very wisely uh, countered it into a back body drop. And now a go behind into an electric chair. Interesting choice of maneuvers. Electric chair execution machine, also known as a Toyota. And we have the Stig bounding up to the top rope. I've never. I love this guy. The elbow drop from the top. One leap, one jump. He's all the way up to the top rope. Feet never touch the second or the bottom rope. The, the Stig is a pure, true athlete, the kind you can only see in the AWL light heavyweight division. Alright, we're going to run down the card for the rest of White Day Massacre. Coming up next, we've got Sentai 1 Red versus Warrior, Hero versus Monster. Later, we've got a three-way, the first ever three-way anarchy match. That's going to be interesting. And wait a minute, follow-through splash! 
Stig hits the follow through, a high speed splash, takes down DJ Smark. DJ Smark is now deep, deep in the yellow zone. A reminder for those of you who perhaps not have not seen AWL before. All wrestlers begin in the green zone. You can see the energy meter uh, name tags at the top of your YouTube window. Wrestlers start in the green zone. They go from green to yellow to red. Once you're in a red zone, you are vulnerable to your opponent's finishing move there. Hisatsuwaza, to put it into Japanese terms. Right now, DJ Smart in serious danger of falling into that dreaded red zone. Continuing down the card for tonight, we've got Sentai 1 Red and Warrior. We've got a three-way Anarchy Contenders match. We've got Gamba vs. Wrestler X in a Falls Count Anywhere match. We've got Tiger Mask and Tiger Jr. in a graduation match. Appropriate enough given this time of year here in Japan. And lastly, we've got Wonder Kid one-on-one -on -one with Wolf for the AWL World Heavyweight Championship. That will be your main event. Champion vs. Champion with the world title on the line. DJ Smart control of the stig at the moment, but he doesn't seem to be doing a lot of damage to his stigness. Is it true that Stig drove the Hummer? Well, makes as much sense as anything else that WCW ever did. And wait a minute! He's got him up for the Shock Jock Lock! DJ Smart has locked in the Shock Jock Lock. That's a deadly, deadly submission maneuver. Makes the Lion Tamer look like a headlock. And DJ Smart, however, able to not able to hold it on. And round Chicago we go with the head scissors. Two minutes left in this five-minute match. Plenty of time left for anybody to pull anything off here. And a nice clothesline after the right hand takes down DJ uh, takes down the stake. I'm sorry. I should remind you that these commentaries are done live. I'm seeing this match exactly as you are seeing it and uh, making these commentaries accordingly. DJ Smart with a go-behind. That's a dangerous position to have him in. And he hits an electric chair. DJ... DJ Smart hits the Stig, and the Stig down into the yellow zone for the first time in this match. 96 seconds remain. What's Smart do? Okay, here we go. A little DJ knee drop. A little razzmatazz. That's DJ Smart's style. He's all about the, the, the show, the, the showbiz, the, um, the, the, flash and the, the flash, if you will. You know, he's going to do those kind of weird dances going into the, the knee drop instead of just, oh, I don't know, hitting the guy. A very uh, almost WWE-style performance. Body slam, and DJ Smart is in the red zone. He is vulnerable to the power lap. He beat, DJ, he beat the Stig with the... DJ Smart beat the Stig with Stig's own move a couple of weeks ago. Will DJ Smart get his comeuppance, get his receipt? Will the Stig take his revenge tonight? We'll find out in the next one minute and five seconds of game time. And wait a minute, DJ Smart with a serious opportunity here. A hookup, he's got him down. Is he thinking running powerbomb? No! Jackknife powerbomb! DJ Smart gets himself back up into the yellow zone. Smart is a master of the powerbomb. He knows several different variations of that move. And that high-speed jackknife powerbomb is just one of them. Right hand. And DJ Smart down into the red again. But Stig, very, very deep yellow, and it's all men red! All men red with 45 seconds to go. Don't adjust your... Don't change... The, don't click on any other videos. Oh, wait a minute, at a sudden reversal! DJ Smart is in control here. He's got the cover. Slowest count in wrestling begins. One, two, three! Out of freaking nowhere! Out of nowhere, DJ Smart pulls it off. Here's your winner, DJ Smart. Stig had this match won. He owned DJ Smart for like 90% of this match. A sudden reversal at the end gives it to the former DJ. Congratulations, DJ Smart. Tough luck, Stiggy. Coming up next, the, le the leader of the Spiro Sentai, Resser Ranger, Sentai 1 Red, takes on one half of the World Tag Team Champions, Warrior in singles action that's next on AWL White Day Massacre.